All right, guys, this is going to be a little difficult since I can't run Zmodel on my computer, but I will do my best. So this is going to be how to put text on Windows. So we're going to be using the Vigero 2, which is the new upgraded one. As you can see, there's nothing in here relating to the glass. What we're really looking for is the YTD. So we're going to go down here to vehicles.rpf because that's what it's pulling it from. We're going to scroll all the way down to wherever vehicle share is. And we need this one. So we're going to export the selected one as PNG to desktop. Shows up here, right? We're going to open this with some sort of photo editing program. It's got to be able to leave the transparency, as you can see. Now, I know this is the back window. So we're going to add our text. We're going to go File, Save As, PNG, hit Save. So if we go in here, we can now drag and import automatically. And now that shows up. We can hit Save. We just got to quickly install these two. We're not going to worry about that. We're going to go back to the root folder. We need this. It's going to say that. Tell it to keep. I like the simple trainer, so I'm going to get that too. Extract each archive to separate folder. We have the main one. Bin folder, you really just need this one. Just drag and import it. Script like v.dll. Turner v, we need the ASI and the INI. Hit run. Alright, so not exactly sure why I don't have game audio showing up. But it doesn't matter. We push F3 to open the Trainer v menu. Go down to vehicle spawning. This is going to be under muscle. Uh, that one, I believe. As you can see, it is mirrored. So the text is on there. You'd have to separately UV map the right side of the windscreen in order for it to only show up on the left side. But that requires access to the program, which I do not have. That is all. Hope this helped.